signed contracts, the shillings with Don Kirshner Entertainment sometime in December. And then New Year's Eve came and I got a call and the receptionist said, I have Don Kirshner on the line for you, Dale. So I said, oh, okay, wow. So Don Kirshner got on. He said, Happy New Year, Dale, and Happy New Year to the Shillings. He said, I'm looking forward to such a great year working with you guys. It's going to be wonderful. We're going to do great things together. He said, I have some people at my home. We're celebrating New Year's. Could I put them on the phone? And I thought, yeah, sure. So I'm thinking, well, maybe they have servers or they have someone, a bartender, is going to wish me well. So first a woman got on and she said, hi, Dale. We, we work with Don Kirshner and we love him and we want to wish you the best. And I said, oh, yeah. And I'm thinking, who is this? She said, uh, this is Edie Gourmet. Edie Gourmet? She said, I'm here. Uh, Don is producing albums with us, so I just want to say hi. She said, let me put my husband on. And I thought, quickly, who's her husband? Hi, Dale. This is Steve Lawrence. Steve Lawrence? I uh, want to wish you and the guys uh, we haven't met. want to wish you a great year. You're going to have wonderful times working with Don Kirshner. And I thought, oh boy. Did I die? Am I dreaming this? It was such a neat experience. But it showed what a great human being Don Kirshner was, and also how gracious Edie Gourmet and Steve Lawrence were. They didn't know us. We were nobodies. And they were taking time out of a party to say Happy New Year and good luck with the shillings and the Kirshner projects. That, to me, is such a good memory. Uh, it'll never be forgotten. Woke up this morning, I was feeling good. He got my window, didn't know if I should. The sun in my face, I jumped out of bed. Went out to the street to the mail, and I said, Why, hello, how are you doing? How are you doing? Looking good. Looking good. Hey, lovely day. Don Kirshner never called me.